Guys, if you're watching this, make sure you subscribe. If you want to watch the whole thing, you can watch it on YouTube, Apple Podcasts or Spotify. Uh, Capital Ball. I saw you at Capital Ball before I met you. Oh yeah. Fucking loved it. Oh, I, lo I love it. It was such a good show. I don't know how you did that. Be brutally honest with you. There's so many people. Oh my God. And, and it's, it's in were, daylight. Yeah. Well. People were passing out everywhere. Oh. I had. This was no. terrifying. So we were in the, because we got, I don't know who we got brought by. But we got brought by someone, like a brand or whatever. So we were in yeah. like the top bit. The VIP. Oh, nice. The VIP oh. band. <laughs> Even though you can't see shit all. But anyway. <laughs> Um, we were there and then these this family comes over, right? And they're all hostile. They're very stressed. I'm thinking, first of all, Mimi Webb's on, have some respect. I'll talk yeah. to you after. And they're like, oh my God, we were stood up. And I was like, okay, what happened? They were like, these youths tried to stab us. I was like, what's happened here? Anyway, it turns what? out some 14 year olds tried to stab them. And the, the mum headbutted I, one of them. Not I, even, I'm not even joking. Yeah. What is going on? Yeah, I know. When I thought, stage. yeah, you had no fucking clue. You were like, house on fire, yeah, just yeah, on the yeah, stage. Mate, I'm not like, a clue. yeah, smiley, yeah, guys, have a good, good this night. Is what I mean, I had no clue. Oh my God, that's mental. Yeah. It's always, oh God. Good on the mum, though, headbutting them. Yeah, yeah, that, yeah, yeah. She's like, bang, get out. She was built like a, a brick shit oh, house really? as well. Yeah, I wouldn't body, fuck with her. I think rate. she'd also been to prison before. Was it lift, body lifter, what they call Body them? builder. Body builder. Or they can lift bodies as well. Fuck them. Do you not get stage fright, though? Um, not as much now, not now. Jesus Christ. I can't even talk in front of a, a crowd it's, of five. Do you know what? It's it's really crazy because you, the adrenaline does stop. It does start to stop uh, a bit. Really? Yeah. And you that's why people are like, what can I do to get the adrenaline? You know? Drugs. Uh, drugs. Yeah, yeah. That's why they're all like, yeah, because they want that feeling, you know? Shit. Like. I'm so, I'm not like that. I've just going to see you in two years. You'll be in rehab. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, God. Oh, God. Started off so well. <laughs> yeah. So well. Innocent, <laughs> yeah. lovely girl. Yeah. Bless Capital her. summertime. Yeah. yeah. But it's weird. Like, you do start, like, all of that, like, even the nerve, the adrenaline, like, you start to, you know, I think, my, like, the first year of touring and stuff, like, I mean, I've, I did, I went straight into it, to be honest, but like, the first, <laughs> went straight in there. Straight but in there. I was just the like, first few shows, I was like, it would take me like a good hour just to calm down those adrenaline, yeah. like hormones after. Jeez. Do you have any, like, do you do anything before you go out on stage? Like, you remember Sharpay would be like, yeah. Bah. Would you do yeah. any of that? Or would you just um, go out there? And... I do. I do a little prayer. Oh. I do. A little cute Say prayer. a little prayer for you. Just nice. to like, yeah, yeah. I'm like, guys, just just so I'm just like, right. Because I feel like it's just, I can't become like a routine now. Yeah. So I feel like if I don't do it, I'm going to have a bad, yes. bad set. So Correct. I'm like, right, little little prayer. Yeah, that's nice. I mean, look, yeah. what could go wrong? Oh, fall off stage. Gosh. Have you had any embarrassing moments on stage before? Yeah. Have you? Yeah, I'll go be time. Right, you ready for this? Yeah. <laughs> to make me feel a lot better story, about my guys. life thank you right so basically i was doing it was the last show of my american tour that i just came off and um i thought i started my period no on on the stage fully freaking out so i'm sitting on a stool at this part yeah. in this part well, thank of the show. Fuck you had a stool first yeah of all. i know and i thought right what i'll do is i'll try and just i'll take the stool off stage myself yeah. this time and like act like i'm meant, meant to be to, going yeah. on stage but i'm actually going off and i'm going to quickly run and double you know go check yeah um, so yeah, so I ran off and oh, and it's the band. I've never done it for the band. So I didn't actually, I didn't give anyone a heads up. Everyone's freaking out. The band like, she's gone. Uh, they're like, she's upset. She's crying. Yeah, so I was like runner. fully heartbroken at this point as well. Oh, so I'm Jesus. like, they're like, she's like, she's gone. She's I think you've off. done a diva moment. Yeah. Yeah. They were like, she's gone. She's, she's, she's done with the tour. Yeah. Fuck Last it. show out, walks out, Jesus. mic drop. <laughs> See ya. Yeah, literally. Um, but yeah, so yeah, but yes, yeah, so then I checked and I'm glad I went off stage. Because there was, there was just a start. It was like the start of my oh period. Oh my so God. Like, so what did you do? Interval? I was like, guys, just keep going. I was like, just keep this going. So they're there like, it was all, it was very awkward. But it was a cute little show. And do you know what? I'd rather I'd do it again. Because you've got to make sure you're, you've got, and I'll do you know, it again. don't want any, you, you know, can't be looking mishaps. like Carrie on the fucking stage. Do you know what I mean? That's diabolical. So fine. you got to do what you got to do. Got to get off stage, double check but it. But you're going on tour, am I right? Yeah. Next year. Yeah. Because you've got. A new album? New album, baby. Oh, yeah. I fucking love it. I'm ready for it. Oh, I'm so What's excited. the inspo for this album? Who's hurt so, you this time? Oh, oh, God. Get them all out. Um, get, <laughs> get them all out, folks. No, it's, it's so funny. Oh, my God. I literally sound like a broken record. I'm actually, guys, I actually haven't dated that many people. And she is mentally fine yeah, at the I'm moment. Yeah, I'm actually stable now. Okay? She it's listens to good. wellness podcasts. So I know yeah, this first time. You know yeah, this, yeah, you know this. You know the drill. Um, but yeah, so yeah, so March 3rd, Amelia's going to be dropped. Um, and 
I really was excited to call it my name, like my actual, actual name. name yeah. And um, just for people to learn more about me as an artist, as a person. And it just kind of tells a story of me more than like a breakup as yeah. such. Um, but there's all a lot of like, there's some sassy songs in there that Ooh. are really inspired by breakups. And, you know, there's some more emotional ones, you know. There's, yeah, there's a mixture. Yeah, like You've got fingers in all people. the pies. Yeah. I like that. That's nice. <laughs> little mixture for everyone. <laughs> I fucking love it. Are you scared to go on tour again? Are you fine with it? Because it's I'm long. Actually, I'm excited. No, it is. It is. Long. I'm actually excited to go on tour this time because I think I'm going to just be focused on myself. I haven't been on tour single before. So yeah. I think it'll just be me not worrying about what they're doing at home, not worrying about keeping that yeah. connection going. Just me being like, no, I'm stable here. This is I where I'm do at. This. Do you have a bus? Yeah. Do ya? Oh, I've always wanted to go on a tour bus. You need to come. I we'll, fucking will. When you come, we'll get you to a show and we'll get I'll you on I'll free the bus. up the date. Don't worry. Oh, I'm on it. Love oh my that. God. Because I feel like, you know, when you watch the behind the scenes and everyone's in the tour bus like, arguing or having fun, I just think that's such yeah. a vibe. It is. It that's really such is. A, I'd be sleeping the whole time, I'll be honest with you, on the little bunk oh, beds. Literally. It's so it's, And that's the thing. It's like with buses, you just think, guys, I'm just going to go for a nap. Like yeah, we all just will fine. nap, nap, nap. It's just. What's so... the best and worst thing about being on tour? Best thing I think is just feeling the growth of your career. Like you just, you see all the you know fans every night, different shows, different venues, different mm. cities. You genuinely feel like you're on cloud nine. Yeah. But like, it's not glam. Like it's not this glam thing. You know, we don't all just go and like do drugs before the show yeah, and after. No. I mean, some people might. Thank you for don't. confirming just, that. Yeah, just they so might, you guys the know. The rumours are there. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. People might think that. But like, we know we don't and we don't do out. Like we don't really, we'll drink after a little bit. But yeah. like. It's very like routine, like you're an athlete. Like yeah, you've you got to stay to, well. Yeah, like, yeah, you need to, because your body will just crash because you're just traveling so much. And like, um, so I think it was def it's definitely like <clears throat> looking after yourself and um, and home life can be tough because, you know, you're there, say seven weeks, you're away from home. Jesus you're, Christ. You feel so out of your comfort zone and then you've got your loved ones back at home living their normal day-to-day -day life. It's mm. like, you, it's just such a disconnect and you feel so lonely like Aww. it's weird yeah I know it sounds really I've got so, the, yeah. I know you feel bloody lonely <laughs> help me no, it's good because I've got the crew so like we're all in the same boat yeah that's the thing as long as you've got people with you yeah imagine you were just on your own in the fucking bus like Jesus oh Christ god that would be horrible but I do get you, what you mean like is obviously it's not the same level but when like I hear like following or like our followers or whatever it's just like a number so you don't actually put it into context and then when you see the amount of people that have say like bought tickets to your show and you're like oh fucking hell these people actually do like me yeah, these are like, yeah. I'm like the oh. people that follow me it yeah. puts it into a what's the word context yeah, they're yeah. All good. come on now context. I did English Guys. yeah <laughs> thank you <laughs> I love it but I'm going on tour as well not for singing obviously <gasps> yes. what tips would you give me um work out and I know oh, it sounds, be realistic I know no maybe, I know I, I know it's tough but I used to really be but I used to eat shit on the road I yeah. mean it's so easy because you just pull in to easy, Mackey's yeah. which I still do pull the bus in yeah he's making yeah. 40 so McFlurries yeah literally yeah. the big we'd all run out quick get our Mackey's <laughs> yeah. get my McFlurry you know, get back in yeah back in hit back in back on the road but you know you do it is easy to fall into that trap of just eating right. crap and just like just because you just think oh I'm working like I'm very like yeah. you're, you're, you know you're really on a roll but yeah just look after yourself right so do some maybe I'll do some star jumps a few star jumps um, a day yeah a star day. jumps <laughs> maybe a lunge here and there and eat some I don't know like some fruit yeah I'll fucking do yeah, it. Just get that health, health. Okay, fine. You. If you guys see me on tour, I'm eating a satsuma. Mind your fucking business. Yeah. Maybe you told me to. 